Hi, I'm Clary, an award-winning Italian designer based in Manchester, UK, where I run my practice Studio Per My Soul. In this clip, you will learn how to create a grid template to display a gorgeous curated Instagram feed. To build long-lasting relationships with my international clientele, I do my best to meet them in person anytime that I can. During my work trips abroad, I enjoy taking photos and share them as a grid puzzle on my Instagram feed to keep my followers engaged even when I'm traveling. Follow along to learn how to slice one image into multiple posts and share them with the world. To open a new window, press on Command N, that's Control N on Windows, and let's start with the size of a single Instagram post, which is 1080 pixels by 1080 pixels. Now to calculate the correct size for the Instagram puzzle 3 by 2 grid, let's multiply the width by 3. To do so, insert the star symbol and then the number 3. Click away and you'll see that Illustrator does the math for you. It will give back the result in the size field. Let's do the same for the height. In this case, we need the height of two Instagram posts. So I will multiply my current size by 2. Insert a star and multiply it by 2 and click away. As you can see, Illustrator has multiplied 1080 by 2 and placed the result in the field. Now name the file Instagram Grid and click on Create. Select the Rectangle tool, click once to bring up the Rectangle window and let's do more math with Illustrator. So let's multiply 1080 by 3 for the width and 1080 by 2 for the height to have the same size as the artboard. Click on OK, then head to the Properties panel to align the rectangle to the artboard both horizontally and vertically. When done, with the rectangle still selected, go to the object menu, Path and Split into Grid. Select two rows and three columns and click on Preview. As you can see, we are almost done building our Instagram puzzle grid. Click on OK and press Command 5. That's Control 5 on Windows. And let's transform our grid in Guides. It's time to bring in the photo or graphic you want to share in your feed. To follow along, you can use the file I provided in this video's asset folder. To bring the image, use the shortcut Shift Command P on Mac, that's Shift Control P on Windows, and click on the image called Valencia. This is a photo that I took during my last visit to Valencia in Spain for a client meeting. Click on Place, then click once on the top left corner of the artboard to insert the image in place. You can resize the photo by holding shift to constrain proportions while dragging down one of the corners of the bounding box, just like so. With the image selected, go to the object menu, slice and create from guides. The artboard is now split in six different slices, each one of the size of a single Instagram post. Before saving and exporting our Instagram puzzle, make the adjustment to your image position and check to have engaging content throughout each post. When done, go to the File menu, Export and Save for Web Legacy. Here, select all the slices by clicking on them one by one while holding Shift. Then, go ahead and select the Destination folder and click on Save. In the Destination folder, you will find a subfolder named Images and in here, you can find the original image split in exactly six assets of the perfect size of an Instagram post. We are ready to post our photo puzzle. When publishing your content, remember to start from the very last slice to achieve the perfect result. Now, it's time to step up your Instagram game with a gorgeous curated Instagram puzzle feed. Now it's time for you to try out these techniques in your Instagram feed. Again, I'm Claudia from Print My Soul and I look forward to working with you in the next project to elevate your business communication strategy.